Well, Sloppy Joe strikes again. The FBI reportedly finding six more secret documents in President Biden's Delaware home. Which Delaware home? I bet he's got several. The White House still claiming this is no big deal, man. Woo! No regrets. Yeah, chug, chug, chug. Uh, well, how big of a national security threat might this become? The Giants' loss to the Eagles Saturday was not the worst thing to happen in New York this weekend. Early Sunday morning, uh, upset when I saw that you had been attacked on the train. So you're doing the right thing. I mean, obviously, you can't sit by and let a, a group of boys hurt an older guy. But you're damned if you do and damned if you don't. Yeah, I love that intro because you talked about the Giants taking a beating. And then I took a slightly less beating. Like, yeah. they got beat a little bit out. Oh. And without even thinking, just like, whoa, you guys can't do that. And then their focus was entirely on me. Did you tell me what I can and can't do? Yeah, How many you, people were there can't on the, do that. At the time? I bet there were 25 or 30 people. You know, you this but were you looking around at people going, anyone going to help me out here? No. I, so when it all began, there was like a little bit of a, are you going to do anything? Are you going to put him to sleep, put him to sleep, put him to sleep? They want to knock me out. So I just Take do, your stuff? No, I just think like they just want to teach me a lesson. Yeah. Like you don't talk, you don't tell me what to do. Wow, what a bunch of little buttholes. Yeah. Um, it, it's, it's really upsetting me. Well said. I, I should have said that to him. I don't know what you're supposed to do. I really don't because as a mom, if I see kids my girl's age doing something, I'm going to be point. But again, at, at some point, you, you have to add everything up. Would you have done anything differently? I mean, I wouldn't have, but I totally understand because... Anger and brute strength. Right. What did we gain? I got beat up. I went to the hospital. They went home. Yeah. Even and though they were caught, they went home. So, like, what, what's the point of saying anything if, that was, or if that's what it becomes? Did you think the crime in the city was as bad as it is before you were assaulted? Maybe I, you lose your life? What no. What was going through your head? I was so calm. I did not think it was... I stabbed and things like that. That never crossed my mind, thankfully, because then I obviously wouldn't that's, No, it's really interesting how... Because you never react the way you think you're going to in those situations. Um, but, I mean, I think you did the right thing protecting a vulnerable person. <laughs>
Well, we'll be right back with Mouth Trumpet Monday. Any requests, send them to Twitter, hashtag Mouth Trumpet Monday. Oh, look, it's flashing. Oh, baby, hallelujah, we made it. It is time for Mouth Trumpet Monday. Uh, if you can guess it on Twitter, you win a hat. Mouth Trumpet Monday is the hashtag. Here we go. See? Did you get it? Thanks so much for watching the best hour of your day. Follow me at Twitter, Instagram, at Kennedy Nation, Facebook, Kennedy FBN, email Kennedy FBN at foxbusiness.com. Tomorrow night, Hannah Cox, the co-anchors of the brand new 6 p.m. show on Fox Business, the bottom line, Sean Debbie, Dick McDowell, Kennedy.